In this video, you'll learn about the accent color CSS property. So what this accent color CSS property does, it allows the page to specify a color used by the form controls instead of using the inbuilt default color. So by default, the color is blue, the one you're seeing on this slider. So using this accent color CSS property, you can specify a certain color or a specific color. Let's say you're trying to match up your website color theme and you want also the controls, the form controls to be having that color. So back then it wasn't possible because you will not come here and select the inputs and say, I want their color to be red. This can cannot work. It's still to be showing the default color, which is blue. But using the accent color CSS property, right? accent dash color and vs code won't understand this css property because let me show you after saving this it's going to be highlighting that css property let's say red save so as you can see vs code doesn't understand this it is saying unknown property so let's say by the time you are watching this tutorial it will already be implemented or not yet but with this, you can go back to the browser and see that our form controls now have the red color. So using this simple accent color property, you can like have a specific color that you want to give to this. It wasn't possible back then. Let's say you can set it to teal and this. Oh, did I save? Accent color, it is teal, not real. <laughs> so teal. So that's the accent color CSS property. As I said, it allows the page to specify a color used by the form controls. So instead of using the inbuilt in color, which is blue, you can use this property and give your form controls a unique color that you want. Let's say yellow. And this is how it and by the way depending on the color you choose the this accent color css property it will get ways of rendering the tick in the middle so as you can see on yellow they make it black if we go to red so depending on the contrast they will make these white so that's how cool it is. In yellow, they make the controls or the tick, the check box black, and the background will be yellow. So it depends on the contrast of the color that you pass in. Let's try green. And this is it. So guys, if this tutorial was useful to you, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel and I will be seeing you in the next tutorials. Peace.